Hello, we are back. More Magic the Gathering. I am addicted. Uh, hopefully this isn't too loud. I'm not sure how I'm going to do this. I kind of plan on... I'm probably going to play for about... Uh, what time is it today? It is 1818. So probably two hours. I don't know if I want to continue to upload long two-hour segments. I don't know if people watch it in the background and they like that. They like the long format. Or if I should start putting them into like 30-minute sections, I guess, episodes. Um, that's a little bit more digestible. I don't know how that... I, I don't know what people would prefer. If you watch these and you care to comment and let me know below... Uh, we'll see what I end up doing here. There's a chance this is either one two-hour long video or there's a bunch of different episodes coming out that are 30 minutes each. Why that matters, I don't really know. What does matter is we're here playing Magic. Uh, last time we left off in the Learning Saga, aside from when I played in bed, played an episode in bed, played an episode, played uh, a game in bed, just one, um, I built this deck... And, uh, spoiler alert, I don't know anything about building decks, and I also don't know why, uh, it just said 52 out of, I don't know why I have over the maximum amount of cards, but anyways, um, I don't think we're going to use that deck, uh, it would help if I did that, I don't think we're going to use that, I, last night while I was playing, playing in bed, I was enjoying this Hungry Secrets deck, so I think we're going to stick with this for now, and potentially do some virulent, virulent, is that how you say that? Virulent Bittersweet. Really liking these, well, these four decks, but more specifically these two. So, let's get into... Let's get into... A game with the Hungry Sacrifice deck, or whatever it's called. That is awfully loud. Uh, I'm going to turn that down just a little bit. And I'm going to actually turn it down for myself as well. Hopefully it's better now. Uh... Er, er. Uh, I like three lands. I like this. That's pretty far right now. That's pretty far. Somebody let me know, because I feel like right now... Uh, I think this is fine, and we hope to draw low mana cards. But we'll see. Is there, like, a way that you should really, like, feel out your... Feel out your, um... Starting hand? Because, like, now, look. I got a... Oh, I guess I could use that to pay an additional land. I have a 7, a 5, and a 5. Like, I'm kind of not... It's not good. I'm going to do this, though, to pay an additional land, even though pay to play an additional land, even though it's not really going to do anything for me right now. I hope that was, like, a good investment up front. That's my thought right now. This is a four. It's a little bit better. Um, let's explore. Got a land. All this land, and I can't... Oh, you know what? I'm going to create a token. I might as well just use the mana right now. Sorry. Um, yeah, I might as well just use the mana right now, right? Ouch. Holy shit. I just took a drink. And, uh... A lot of shit happened. Okay. Um... 2-5. I mean... 
This is good defensive, but I really would like the descend. I can't play that. I'm going to play this on the hopes I might jabate. Do I have to pay? Do I have to pay this one plus the two from here? Or do I just pay this one? I guess we'll find out. Uh, I'm not gonna attack, I don't care. Uh, do I have to pay the one to use this ability plus pay the two to actually sack the food? Or do I just pay this and this like overrides this? When it ETBs, target player draws one card and loses one life. I will actually take a card if you're going to cast that on me. Fuck. <laughs> Tiny bones. The pickpocket. When it ETB... Oh, no. When it deals damage to a player, you may cast a target non-land permanent from the player's graveyard. I say any mana. Oh, and it has death touch, so it's always going to hit you. And mana of any type can be spent on this. Oh, not any amount of mana. Any type. Oh, that's pretty cool, though. Uh, what are we doing? It's my fault. I'm the dummy. Uh, one attack. Okay. Nope, that's not what I meant. Oh, yeah. Yep, that's fine. We'll do that. Uh, we're going to find out right now. You only pay the one. Fuck! I thought that meant it had trample. Oh, my God. Bruh. Thought that logo was trample. <laughs> Whatever. Um, okay, so I feel like we need to just reel it back in right now. I need to get this out and I need to get cards in the graveyard. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Can I not just block that and just take the. a great time right now. I've never even seen this card before. Mill seven cards, then put a creature, enchantment, or land card from among the milled cards onto the battlefield. don't have enough to do anything. Um... Oh, that's a creature. I don't know why, for some reason, I thought that was not a creature. Oh, 
Oh, I can tap it for mana. Okay, so it's just like another. Okay. Now this has flying. Which is like the only thing that's fine right now. Spell costs two less if it's bargained. So that means it only costs three. When it ETBs, you get three life. That's also not terrible. Okay, now we're starting to be able to do things, I think. Just this, okay? I mean, that's not really gonna do anything. I know that this creates a token, another one of these, but really didn't do much. Um, all right, so now what we need to do is, this can come in for two, less. Oh no, I need to bargain first, okay, sorry. Um, can I? Discard a card, return Bramble Familiar to its owner's hand. Uh, never mind. Okay, well, land for turn anyway. I guess what I can do is this. And if I have enough left over, I do not have enough. Uh, Costs two less if it's bargain. I can't bargain it though. Can I play this without? Didn't think so. I'm just gonna play this. Draw a card. Next, I'll get a food token, and then I can cast this. one plus a number. I'm gonna lose the plus number of food tokens you control, but I will get this for... Well, I don't know if I need that two mana. I might actually be better to take that extra one one and put it on Frilled Cave Worm. So it will be two plus two six seven? Okay. That's fine. I need more cards going to the graveyard. Holy shit, we got a lot going on. Okay, so. Mm, when it ETBs, you may mill two cards and it gets X. So five. Loss of five and zero. The thing is, nothing is big right now. So I kind of don't really care. Uh, I almost have enough to play this without. I think I'm going to wait for this to trigger this and then play this. So just one more turn. And I want to keep this to block. So I'm going to say no attackers. And enter. I feel like that I'm letting their board get too big right now. But I just want this to trigger. Throw that on here. Then sack the food for less mana. Even though, well, I guess mana is kind of always a problem. But I actually don't think mana is like too much of a problem right now. I just feel like I need stuff on the board.
Okay. What can I do? Tap this for one? Discard a card, return it to an... Oh. Actually, it'd be really great to get that sorcery adventure right now. Or that, uh, yeah. I would have to pay to return it, but... Alright, here we go. Actually, I feel like I want to put... It on here, because I can hit this face. I'm gonna do that. Now... Fights up to one creature you don't control. So I can knock out... That is death touch. Alright, what about... Do I have enough mana to do this without? I do. And on top of that, I'm going to do this, and I'm going to do it to, can you sacrifice another permanent? Here. Now. Now, I don't want to swing yet because this has death touch. This is so close. I need one more card to go to the graveyard. Although, whenever you cast a permanent spell using mana produced by it, if one target permanent you control becomes a copy of that spell until the end of the turn. If I swing with that, I don't know if that really matters. Look at the top two cards of your library. Put one of those cards in your hand, the other into the graveyard. That's going to trigger that. Nice. I'll take that. Other one goes in the graveyard, triggers that. Now we can play this. And I'm going to force... That would kill me. This. Yep. No. Yes. I have to ward? Yes. I don't care. Oh, I could have done 4-4 four, four and then taken out the... Eh, whatever. Uh, next. No. Now I'm going to discard a card... Return this to my hand. Can I do that? I can't. I don't have enough. I have to pay one green. To tap it and discard. Wait, can't I actually do that? Why can't I do that? Oh, one plus green. Never mind. Um... So, uh, what the fuck? Oh, okay. I was gonna actually like figure out who I needed to block who, but look at that. Starting off with a dub. Let's go. Okay. 
Run it back. Run it back. That was good. This guy's name is Bruh. <laughs> Solid name. I can already tell you, that's not it. This is also not it. This is kind of nice, but... Not it. This is not great. This is not a good first hand at all. I got nothing here. I guess I could use this for a white human and food because I don't have shit else, but it's not good. Ay -ay -ay. Okay, um. Excuse me. Um, no attack. This is not great. What can I do on this battlefield? Looks like a frowny face. See that? Rexian mana can be paid with either. Oh, okay, cool. Uh, look at the top four cards of your library. Put one of them in your hand. Rest to the graveyard. I feel like I need that right now. This is food, right? Okay. That's I've never seen that one before. Let's do that. Put one of them in your hand and three to the graveyard. This will give me more draw, which will bring this up to four. Descent, and then... What the f fuck is that? When invasion, when an ETB, search your library for up to two basic land cards, put them on the battlefield path, then just drop them. When it dies, it transforms into that thing with... And as long as it's on the battlefield, it's a land in addition to other types. That's cool. Here's the annoying thing. Choose one to put on the top of your library. Oh, I have food, so this could actually be nice. Let me pay, play an additional land, reach. Now this is 4-4. Four, four. We are not going to attack. Oh, I still don't have the mana to... 
I should have saved mana so I could either Titanic Growth or tap this for 3-3 three, three, so I could block this and kill it. I will block with that though. And that again. And I can kill that and block that and not die. And it's kind of fine. Overgrown pass. That's cute. I like that card. There's a lot of stuff going down on the board over there. Um, I kind of need my own shit to start popping off here. Okay. Put one one. Oh, put one one target creature. It gains trample and haste until end of turn. Create a tapped power stone token. Is he gonna load up something here to hit this to get another creature? I don't know. I can sack this. This. I'm good. I feel like this says Invasion of Zandalar. Like from WoW. No, it doesn't. Very interesting card. Wow. That's a big boy. I need something to kill that right now. Holy. Um. I mean, if it swings, I can throw that on him. But wow, that's big. Which means I need to save. I need to save. This is four. And this is two. And I have five. So I can't do it, of course. Um. Shit. Oh, but I will get a food that can tap for mana, right? Hopefully. We're gonna find out. Yes, so see, I still have this. Okay, so next. No attack. End turn. I hope this swings at me. I throw this 4-4 four, four on here. Kill that. Um, should be okay. I just hope he swings it at me and doesn't just keep it on that side of the battlefield. When ETBs, you gain life equal to its power. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Yep. Swing at me. Swing at yes. No. You fucking Okay, uh huh. So I can block nothing. Oh, I could have. Mm, I'm so dumb. Why did I do that? No. Change my mind. This. This this to this block pass I should have tapped this so I could have killed something stronger uh okay
it literally prompted me and I was like, oh, I'm not gonna do that. And then I switched my step, immediately regret. Uh, uh, it's okay, you live and you learn. This has flying, which is cool. I can force this to fight something. So why don't I do that? I can't, oh, I can. But it's too much mana, it's too much mana. I need to keep this, otherwise I'm screwed. So now I have one, three, five, six. I have six. I could pay four and I should have two left. Yes, okay, still have two. The only thing that's saving me right now is having this in my back pocket. Because this is a truck. Look at this thing. Copper Host Crusher. Trample and Hexproof and an 8-8. Phyrexian Bear Rhino. Like, wh what even is that? Choose two, create two. Oh, wow. Put two. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh my god. Holy shit. When it ETBs for life. Okay. What the fuck? I think I'm dead. Okay, so what are we gonna do now? We will. I mean, I got nothing really. Play this is flying. Play this. I can't kill anything with this though, which is rather unfortunate. I can do this, draw a card, and hope for the best. That was not what I needed. When it ETBs, if there are four more permanent cards in your graveyard, that would help a lot right now if I could get that on the battlefield, but it does not help me right now. I think that's good game. Okay, so I can do... kill that and I guess I'm just blocking this Wow gonna play it again and buy myself one more turn I guess he's just gonna play it and get the life this guy's gonna have like 40 life yeah. uh, 
Uh, yeah. I don't know. Block. Block. Bruh has a stacked deck. All right, one, 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 one. Okay, while well, I'm waiting for this, is this game gonna take that long? I'm gonna go, nah. Laundry's done, I need to go change it. Elver Gata. Gata what? <laughs> uh, this is fine. Can't do the fetch quest with this, but aside from that, I think it's fine. I like that I'm gonna get extra mana off this. I think we keep extra mana early on. I can get this, um... Excuse me, that was probably gross in the microphone. I can get this out early, even though... Oh, actually, yeah. Craft with the island, so I need four to do that. But it's not that good. Like, really, it's not. I like the descend mechanic, though. I think what we're gonna do is do this first. Because it's gonna act as a. I can, I can tap it for mana, potentially. And then probably get these two out next turn if I can tap this safely. When ETBs create a food token, target non creature artifact you control becomes a 4 4 until end of turn. Enters tapped. Let's do this. Excuse me. Um, and we will use that for mana. Get this out. I'm actually going to tap and change this into a thing that I can swing with, I think. Because I got nothing else right now. Tapped. Create a one one. Um. All right. Let's do this. This. Tap this. Oh, you can do that for. Whoa! I didn't realize that this was a. Oh, wow. That's pretty sweet. Nice. I can tap this to my card. Why not? Uh, we're going to swing with this. This and this. Not this. I like that mana. Can't kill this, and I don't care if it kills this. 
So. And then I have this to block. This is great. I did not realize that you could do it with food. That makes so much sense. Too bad I couldn't get this to trigger before. That's a really cool card. It has toxic and... Exile a target artifact or creature an opponent controls his mana value three or less until it leaves the battlefield. Shit. Thank God, because I really didn't care about that. Especially not right now. Not until I have eight in the bat. Yep. Although it did just take my... Oh no, it didn't take my food though. Hopefully you can't hear my dog. It's barking. Um... We're going to load up Tough Cookie here. Then we're going to play Land for Turn. Then we are going to... Do I care? I don't want the land. I don't want that right now. Do I care about counter? You know what? I'm going to do it. Because... Oh no, I got all good cards. Um, I was hoping I would only have to choose one. I think I'm gonna choose this. There's my reminder telling me to do my laundry. Um, where X is the number of permanent graveyard, permanent cards in your battlefield. I just wish this didn't go in there, but oh well. Um. Nothing is scary right now. I want to skip, I think. It's fine. It's fine. We will skip. Uh, when it ETBs, look at the target opponent's hand. You may exile a non-land card from it. Oh, no. Okay. Okay. Shit gonna take this thing until it leaves the battlefield that sucks <laughs> no way oh my god I can't wait to go back and watch my face right there 40 Holy, I do not care about this at all. I don't care about that. This is what's going to save me. And now I'm dead. Okay. We're not doing too hot right now. Can't do that. Yikes. This is not good. Do I have eight cards in here yet? Oh, I can check. Seven. No way. Mill seven cards and put a creature from among the milled cards onto the battlefield. So I can press one to return it. Or I can press one. I can tap... And it costs seven to do fetch quests. I don't have enough. That's unfortunate. Um, dang, this sucks. Okay. I got nothing. Literally nothing. The only plays I had just got taken.
that's not good at all. At the beginning of your turn, target creature you control gets plus one, plus one. If that creature has toxic, give it two, two. Toxic, excuse me, give it two, two. So can I knock that out to, wait, is this the same? Oh, that's cool. Okay. I'm gonna put it on here and make that a three, six. I can make it lose five. It will swing at me, it won't die. Did I miss my opportunity to do that? Can I not? Why? I have this. I don't understand. Okay, I guess for s that's fucking flying. Oh my god. Hmm. That was not worth it. Instant regret. Why couldn't I use this? I don't understand. Well, I got the first play I can do. I can make that fight me, right? That returns to my hand. I... Fuck, I can't play it. I don't have enough mana. I don't know what kind of style these cards are, but they're really cool. Whatever that set is. This set, that's really cool. I like it. Give it to that. Three, six. I can make it lose five. I, well, actually I can't, because I don't have enough mana. Unfortunate. Can make what is this gonna do? It gets one one and has lifelink. It's like kind of whatever. I need to save this for well, like at this point, I'm kind of out of options. Unfortunately, I could get this back, which will now. All right, let's do... No, I can't. Um... Excuse me. I want this to attack without being plus two. Wow. There is a lot going on with this battlefield right now. Holy shit. Put it on somebody else and swing at me with this, for the love of God. But he's probably smart enough to know that I want that. Of course. That's it? Ah, okay. Oh, oh. Just that, huh?
okay. Uh, oh, I love Magic the Gathering. This is so awesome. Like, what the f am I supposed to do right now? All I can do is drop this to a zero. And then, like, what does that do for me? I have nothing else to do. Oh, I can mill two cards. Which doesn't really do anything for me, but yeah. Oh, I guess he could block with anything. For some reason, I was like, oh, he'll block with one of these 1-1s, one -ones and I can get rid of these 1-1s. One -ones. But he can just block with something that's... Oh, okay. Well, there you go. Because now he's going to swing at me with... I can't use this to block this death touch. That was kind of a stupid move. On my part... I needed to save this thing. Okay. Draw a card, look at the top three cards of your library, put one of them in the top and the rest of the graveyard. I need to draw a card right now. lands. I I just simply do not need any fucking lands. I really don't. I just I just don't need any. Could I just get something other than lands at this point? That would be really nice. Like, anything. Anything. Look at this. Like, what the... Oh, that art is so cute. Um, when ETBs, target creature you control, gains 2 plus... Plus 2, plus 0, and gains indestructible until the end of turn. Awesome. Yeah. Wait, why did he give it to himself? Because he can't attack with that. Oh, does it have haste? No. What is swamp cycling? Discard the cards at your library for a swamp, reveal it, and put it to your hand and shuffle. That's a terrible trade. <laughs> Alright, what are we saying here? Um, I really want to keep this for this, but I don't want to take this to the face, so unfortunately, I have to do that. And then we'll just get rid of these. 
and call it a day. You may play an additional land this turn. Adventure, you may cast this card as an adventure. You may then cast this card later from exile. I don't need an additional land this turn. That's great. You know what? This is risky, but if I swing and hit him, but he blocks with this thing, I get... Oh, never mind. Not worth it. I thought this was this. And I was like, well, I'll get that back, but I will not. This thing's gotta go. I need a card that can, like, destroy this or something. When it ETVs, exile target creature, planeswalker, and opponent controls until it leaves the battlefield. Awesome! Oh my god. Yep, sounds good to me. Like, I'd just love anything at this point. It's not that hard, buddy. You're gonna win. Just, just do it. Yep. Fuck my face, huh? <laughs> I mean, I'm just gonna block with these and be open and die. I don't know. Just, this is insane. Wow, another fucking land. <sighs> okay, I'll be right back. I need to call Yugi and tell him that the heart of the cards is not with me right now. At all. I need the heart of the cards. And I've been believing in the heart of the cards, believe it or not. And the heart of, heart of the cards has not believed in me. We started off with a good dub, and then it's all sadness from there. Um, this whole hand sucks. Of course. Six, three, four, five. Like, what is that? Also sucks. Here, uh... Good enough. Don't care. I can at least get this out early for extra mana. This is such an interesting card. What can I do in this room? I can. Oh yeah, I can eat. I can eat the food. Excuse me. Um, that was so ironic. That timing was hilarious. Ah, 
Nice. This doesn't help me right now, but... Choose up to one to put at the top of your library, the rest will go to your graveyard. Ah, uh, dang. I guess right now? Need some food. Oh, this, doesn't this actually give me food? So then I can do this next turn. Plus it lets me... Uh, oh, wow. Oh, yeah, it becomes a 0-0, zero, zero, and then doesn't it get 4-4 four, four or something interesting? should have attacked, because I ain't going to hit anywhere. Oh. They've been... Five! Five! Transforms pit. Put a 1-1 one, one counter on. I'm dead. Wow. That's, uh, that's pretty nutty. Okay. Good game. Good game. wild how fast <sighs> wow i don't know if i really care unless i get something here All right, well, at least the first game was good, you know? Holy shit. You know what? Let's switch up the deck. I'm gonna try whatever this is. Uh, looks like I'm not getting anywhere. Learning is frustrating. I mean, a lot of it is probably just like you would have naturally lost, but. Yeah, 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 yeah. Express yourself with emotes or stick. Uh, does nobody play this game mode? Okay, never mind. Is this is that your rank or something oh my goodness okay so land anything right it's not really great either but a cool island, please. It's 
a cat beast mount. Okay. So what does that do? It is now saddled. Whenever it attacks while saddled, oh, it gains first strike. Isn't this a red-black deck? Why am I getting all the blue cards? Uh, when it ETBs, if a creature died this turn, create a 2-2. Two, two. So I'm going to lose... I'd rather lose this 1-1 one, one than lose this 2-2. Two, two. Duke at Nero at a team. want that card for my blue my blue green deck. What the fuck? That's so cool. Uh, okay. It's gonna kill me. Whatever. Then it's gonna swing again. Oh, never mind. You have to tap that to give plus one. And when you tap that, you can't attack.
Learning. Learning, learning, learning. Learning, 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 learning. I just have to get seven wins with this thing. All right, let's try again. That's a cool after. Am I crazy? Is this not? Did I not make this a black red deck? What the hell? Oh, this is an enchantment. Oh, I thought it was an artifact. I like the plot. Um... I like the plot mechanic. You can basically play it now for later. Negative three three is not quite enough to kill it, huh? I can block it, I guess. I don't like this deck. I don't know if I just don't like a lot of decks or I'm just bad. I feel like I'm just bad, but we'll see. I feel like I made this a red black deck and I have all this blue mana and it like doesn't synergize at all. I get some mana? I swear to god, it's either all you're getting is mana when you need creatures, or all you're getting is creatures when you need mana. <sighs> what the hell? And 
and it enters sap, of course. And it's still not red, of course. Do I have to enchant something? I don't really get this. Oh, it just goes there permanently. Anyways, I got nothing, so... I don't care. I don't even want to play this. Oy, oy, oy. Uh, can I get one win today? Or I guess the second? Because I did win the first game, and then I lost three games after that. This is alright. I mean, this is kind of useless for the first while, but aside from that, yeah, it's fine. Why do you use that this early on? Nice. I mean, this card doesn't do me any good right now, but I really wanted a plus one, plus one here. Good. Four, four, three, two.
Is that enough? Like a send from heaven. Oh my god. The MTG gods hurt. Oh, he can still kill me though. The MTG gods hurt me. How can I get that to a plus, a plus one plus one on that? I mean, I can block Mocking Spray. And I can trade with this, which would not really be ideal, but it would also get something into my graveyard. I love that art. Am I playing the same deck I played before? I feel like that's what's happening right now. Okay. You look in an opponent's hand, exile a non-land card. Nice. That's great. Please get rid of the ever-flowing well. Nope, you did not. Got rid of the only good card in my hand. Uh, I guess I'm gonna trade. That stays? Oh. <sighs> it's a hollow learning experience. should have taken the food first. Dang it. I should have taken the food and then used the remaining mana to play it again. So then I would have had two turns of getting 2-2. Two, two. And this guy can hit me because these are both mine. I have nothing against that. Pay the one. So I'm not too worried about that. To make this a 5 4. Oh, actually, it doesn't. Yeah, it's fine. Um. Link. Nice. Apparently, I didn't have enough. This is a great day of learning magic. Right on there. Go ahead. So at least I can get a 4-4 four, four and block this thing and not die. That's a cool card. 
I feel like I say that all the time. Are you, are you playing this? Play it. Does this exile card come back to my hand when this thing dies? Oh, it doesn't matter because this only takes away the. Mm. Oh, that's the best I can do. Play the land. Fucking eat the food, apparently. That's it. That's all I got. This is everything. This sucks. This day of magic has been absolutely terrible. Back to back to back to back. Absolutely terrible games. Wow. I don't care. I'm not playing this. Fucking drawing nothing. Seriously. Uh, let's just maybe, if we're lucky, get one win before... Just one win would be nice. Just one. Spark ranked. Wait, I can't use this? Can I use it now? Why? I don't I don't understand. What? How do I know what the pro Oh. I can't use that. Okay. Can I just, I don't know, just give me a, anything else. This deck has the following issues. It must be at least 60 cards. Oh. Uh, okay. Has to be 60 cards. Uh, okay. One. Mm. Two. Five. 
six. I'm just like literally grabbing random stuff. This is a toxic deck, right? Seven, eight. Really wasn't prepared to make this deck. Can I, like, cards that have toxic? I guess not. need to be in like the four five six range right oops four five six yeah so let's collected and in inventory why is this red i guess we'll find it um Um, I'm just kind of grabbing whatever. That could be good. And let's do in deck, collected and in inventory. Till the end of turn. I don't know, let's try that. Deck contains cards that are not in your collection. Oh. Ah! That's not what I wanted to do.
sorry about that. Um, what do we want? Collected and in inventory. So I can do up to these outlined ones. I don't know why I'm making this deck. I don't even really want to use it. Um, oh, that could be good. Actually, uh, da, da, da. sure, let's try that. And ETBs, each opponent discards a card for her. sure, 59 need one more um draw a card and you lose one life destroy an enchantment remove up to three counters counters remove three counters from target permanent three counters I don't really know what that means three counters oh I only have one of these three counters I have one, so I guess I'll try it. Anything else that's black and green? Why does it show me all the- oh, because colorless. Ooh, that's pretty good. Oh, I feel like I want another one of these. I don't know. All right, well, that was a pathetic way to run a deck, but let's What does alchemy play? Is this other people? I feel like it's not. I feel like I need to do ranked. This is probably going to be even worse because people are probably going to be sweating in here. Minstrosity is so funny. He has more. Oh, you can have more than sixty cards, huh? Five cats. Oh, you can cast this from your hand. That's pretty sweet. 
Actually, no. You can cast that from your... Like, you don't have to... using that negative 2-2 was a good call that early on, but I'm not going to be able to play anything this turn anyway, so it's a good time to use it. Unless it has something with haste. Which may be. Uh, when it attacks, they're tapped and attacking. Good four card. Oops, sorry. Uh huh. Whenever it deals damage to a player, you may cast a target non-land permanent from the pl from that player's graveyard. From that player's. What a non-land permanent from the player's graveyard, and mana of any type can be spent to cast it. I think we're gonna get the boy out. This is the guy. Necrogen Rot Priest. Frexrin, Frexrin, whatever. Total power and toughness of five or less. Wait, what? Wait, destroy it with a total power and toughness. This card sucks. I thought it meant that both the power and the toughness separately had to be less than five. That sucks. I don't have any creatures in my graveyard. begins. Flying. Whenever one or more creatures, they gain indestructible until the end of turn. Okay. Not good. Do I not understand what death touch means? Any amount of source damage deals to creatures enough to destroy it. Oh my god, it has indestructible. <sighs> learning. We're learning, everybody. Always learning. Always learning. Well, let's bring the home view back. I can't pay for it. Is 
Is this gonna attack again and create two more? Oh my god, it is. That's a good card. I want to make a white deck. I miss having a white deck. I need to take time and actually make decks, I think. Because I'm just playing with the pre-made decks and I feel like it's not good. Yikes. All right, so these are indestructible. These are not. Um, just take one of those. I need to get rid of this thing. It can't be destroyed by damage? What? So there's no point of even blocking it? Wow, okay, well, I gotta start. I hate this card sucks. I'm so I want I'm just taking this card right out. Garbage. What is what is the use of that card? Where is it? Out. I'm dumb. I don't know. Oh, this one. No. Out. Out. Get out of my deck. Never come back. Oh my god. What an absolutely useless card. Um... Deck contains cards that are not in your collection. This one. <laughs> I really don't need that either. Forsaken Miner. Two or less. Power two or less. Can be paid with either that or two lives. Two life. Turns into that. When it turns into that... Create a one and, or when it dies, create a one one green Frixian. Two of those, and I'm going to get rid of something, because that's what I want. Uh... Oops. Hmm.
Oh, wait, it has... Ah, ah, what am I doing? No, 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 no. How do I get out of here? How do I get rid of this? There we go. All right. Can I... I'm just kind of all over the place right now. I want to go back to this. Well, this person's obviously very good. So, I feel like I don't even have a chance. But we will run it. It's actually a fine hand for once. Wait. There's an avatar and a picture of this person? Full stack rack. I want to get one more win before I'm done. This is such a... I'm so dumb. It's my turn. I'm so fucking sorry. Uh, Alright, we're already off to a bad start. That's my shit. A few times been around that track. Cause I ain't no holla back girl. I ain't no holla back girl. This is awful. Couldn't put me in a worse situation right now. Each opponent loses two life, and this costs one less for each creature in your graveyard. That's actually pretty cool. Battlefield Butcher. So much stuff that is all useless. Seven, I have three. Uh huh. I really would like the fetch quest. This does me no good. 
as a creature. Except for giving me extra mana. I can pay it towards my hand later, I guess. Do we have anything with death touch? Nope. Go ahead. Can do it on that. Yep. I don't even remember where these. Is there four or more permanents in my graveyard? No. This is not good. Alright, slap me in the face. I need something. Anything? I need card draw. Can I tap any of this for card draw? Discover four exile cards on top of your library until you exile a non-land card with mana value four or less. You may cast it without paying its mana. Okay, maybe. That's it. That's all I can do. We'll see if I really need it. When enters a battlefield. You know what? Let's do that because then more stuff goes into the battlefield. Oh, I have to pay five for that. Whatever. One I don't control. Oh. I don't know if I should have just swung right now, but that's what my god told me. Any backs? Ooh, wow. Draw three cards, create... With flying, this creature can block only creatures with flying. God. Finally. Finally. <sighs> oy, oy, oy. I don't know why that was so hard. We're going to end on a high note.
we are going to end on a high note because I have a big day of school tomorrow and also it's been a rough day so the fact that we just got a win end on a high note oh my gosh that was brutal still learning a lot um so yeah thank you to anybody who was watching and if you play this in the background that's cool if you actively watch that's really cool and i appreciate it um could you let me know if you would prefer to have a long i think i'm going to upload this in one long session this one but going forward would you rather have like a bunch of 30 minute episodes or do you like having these long ones my guess is maybe that people kind of watch this on like a second monitor while they're doing something and they like the long stuff but i don't really know because that's what i do excuse me so anyways let me know um this day was not great. Ended on a high note. Started on a high note. Learned a lot in between. So thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. And uh, look forward to seeing you again shortly. Take care. Bye.